YouTube. Today I'm back with another video. And as y'all see by the title, you know, I'm finna be showing y'all how to remove a headliner. Now, a few videos ago, I had redid, not redid, but I had did the stars on my roof. But I ain't really like going detail on how to take the headline out. And since that video, I've been having a lot of people asking me, like, you know what I'm saying, how you actually take it out step by step. So I'm finna be showing y'all in this video how to take it out step by step. Now, I ain't gonna be removing a headliner, but I'm gonna be showing y'all every part that y'all need to remove and every, and every boat that y'all need to remove and how to get to it. So without further ado, let's get right into it. First thing you're gonna have to do is remove these panels. And by removing these panels, all you gotta do is like literally pull on it, like your hand right here and just pull out. Well, you can pull this out right here. Like, go behind this rubber piece and just pull. Unless you got, like, a... I don't even know where that piece is. Oh, let me find that piece, and I, I found the piece. Now, y'all will need some pieces like these. You know, to, like, actually put up in there and pull it out if y'all want to use your hands. But with some of these other pieces... You will have to use these type of tools. Or you can use a screwdriver, uh, a flathead screwdriver. But you're going to have to remove this. Just pull it out. And the same thing on the other side. So next, you will have to... You see your visor? This piece right here, you will have to actually... Matter of fact, I'll pull this one off for y'all. There. So you're gonna have three of these bolts that you're gonna have to unscrew on each visor on the uh the passenger and driver visor, and then right here on this, it's a uh, let me see, it's a little clamp piece that you gotta remove. You gotta pull that tab out, and I say get a flathead for this, for this, it's small. So, let me see if I can. So I couldn't get this one out, but I got the passenger side one out. So, literally, this piece that goes right here, it's a tab that's right behind it that you're going to have to pop out. Then you'll see the screw behind it. And then you just unscrew it. And then the same thing with the driver's side. There's going to be three bolts that you're going to have to unscrew. And each visor, you know, going to have these little tabs that you're going to have to you know what I'm saying? Just pull it out. And then you really don't have to remove these. But if you want to, you can. You would just have to get your little tool and get up in there and pop it out. You see how, it, you know, easy it is right here. Like it's already ready to pop out. But you just put that up in there and you just pop it out. This right here, I need to clean. I know I need to clean my uh my mirror off but this right here you just push it back like literally like take your hand and push it back like hold your hand up here and push back and it just pop out and this oh yeah one more thing you just have to take this piece off and all you gotta do right here is just pull that out and you will have to unplug this you see this right here you have to unplug this and then there's gonna be another wire, wire for the visor but you can leave that in there All right, got that out the way. So next, uh, go to the back seat to get to the side panels. And the side panels, you see right here where it's the airbag? You get you a little screwdriver, get your little piece. And you see behind it, you will find a, I think this is an eight millimeter bolt. You have to unscrew that. And it's gonna be the same on the other side. But you have to screw, unscrew that first and then literally just take your hand and just pull out. And this whole piece come out right here at one time. 
And then next, I already got this piece popped out for y'all. But this piece, you're going to have an airbag, another airbag uh, thing right here. And you just pull that out. And then you're going to see another bolt that you have to unscrew. And then you'll just, like, take your finger under here. Or you can go do it from the window. Just take your finger and pull it out, you know. And then pop this whole piece off. And you just do the same thing on the other side. And for real, for real, that's it. If you, that's all you want to do to take. Oh, yeah, one more thing. You have to um, pop these out, too. Just get, get your little tool and, you know, put it up in there and pull out and pull on it. And you're going to have two, one right there, and then there's another one right here. And also, I think that's about it. Yeah, that's it. But another thing that I did when I had, oh, no, you, you would have to take this piece out. You had to take these off, too. Pop each one of these out for the panel that's covering the, the speakers. And all you do with this is you pull up on it, you lift up on it, and then you just take it out. And you will have to remove that too to get to these. You're gonna have one on this side, and then you're gonna have another one on this side, and you just pop each one of them out. The same way that you pop these out. And you just lift up, and then they'll come right out. And that's to get this wire that's back here. Because it's a wire, and they go to the back. Yet you're going to have to unplug to take the headline out. And if you want to remove your back seats. And if you want to remove your back seats, all you have to do is stick your fingers under here and just pull up. Now, you will have to tug on this real hard because it's in there. But it ain't going to break nothing or nothing. Just pull up real hard and the back seat will come out. And then this... You just pull your little tab right here, and then you literally, like, take your hand and put one hand under here, and put one other hand on top, and lift up. And you will have to pull that, too, if you want to take your back seat out. And that's all there is to it. And the rest of these panels, like this whole piece right here, just underneath this, the seatbelt thing, after you remove it. And if you want to remove all this, this whole panel with a speaker head, you just... Put your fingers behind behind it and just pull it out. For real, you can just do it from the window and then just pull everything out. And everything just pop out and pop back in. And that's about it. Because everything else is just rubber pieces that you just, you know, you pull out. And just pull it down. But yeah, that's how you remove a headliner. You know, it ain't hard. I know I had to figure it out for myself because when you look on YouTube, you don't see nobody really taking the headliners out of uh, 2016 through 2021 Camaro. So I figured why not make this video, you know what I'm saying, help some people out. Because I ain't, you know, like I said, I couldn't find nobody who was doing this video. So I had to figure it out on my own. But if you like the video, like, comment, subscribe, share. You know what I'm saying? Stay tuned for all my upcoming videos. I got a whole lot more to come from my car. And if y'all ain't seen my car, if y'all new, and y'all just heard to I remove the headliner, this is my 2020 Camaro right here. I call it Snow. You know, you got the custom stripes that say Snow to Camaro on top. You know, black the front out. You got the rims with the blue in the back to match. You know, keep up with Devo. You know, so go on here, like, comment, subscribe, sir. Click the, hit the notification bell, and I'll catch y'all in the next video. I'm out.